I'm Marissa. Thank you for coming tonight. We appreciate your support. What are you hoping to gain from your experience with coming to this event tonight? Well, the Thomas International Center has played a tremendous role in the growth of Catholic intellectual life on Duke's campus. I'm a Duke University student, uh, a senior, and I'm involved in the Duke Catholic Center, um, and particularly our academic programming. And so Duke has about I think, 18 or 19 students who will be coming tonight. So we see this as, I mean, certainly a celebration of the Thomas Center's relationship with the Duke Catholic Center and um, an opportunity for sort of laying the, the seeds for future, future collaboration. There will be a lot of freshmen and sophomores who will be here. So um, it's an opportunity to introduce those who may not, within the Duke community, sort of future students who will be very involved in the Catholic Center, to introduce them to the Thomas Center, to Fulvio, and to uh, set the stage for you know, future collaboration. That's wonderful. What do you hope those future collaborations to be, or what, what do you see as the dream and, and the fruition of all the hard work that's being put into the Thomas Center? Sure. The, the Thomas Center, and Fulvio especially, has, has done a great job in augmenting our lecture series. So Fulvio is presented on three occasions. We'll be having him back next semester. So really, really every semester, is, as long as he's available, we'd, we'd love to have him. And he actually also orchestrated an additional talk um, with a professor from New York City who came down. So, um, I mean, insofar as what the future plans would be, I mean, just sort of continued collaboration uh, with the lecture series, but also Fulvio's offered, I mean, perhaps to help either teach an extracurricular seminar or mentor students intellectually, spiritually, um, in ways that sort of the Duke, you know, Duke's institutional advising system doesn't offer or the secular curriculum won't offer. So, uh, yeah, lots of, lots of opportunities for collaboration. That's wonderful. What do you think about the Cardinal being here and the influence and the impact that he will have on not only young Catholics like yourself and the others that are coming from Duke, but as on the Catholic community as a whole here in North Carolina? Well, it's awesome. I mean, this is my first time meeting a Cardinal of the Catholic Church. That's a huge deal. Uh, and Cardinal Burke, I mean, he's very well known. He's a very sound thinker. I'm really excited to hear what he has to say tonight. And I think I, what, I think what it'll do, I mean, because it's 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 not I don't think I don't think it's that easy for sort of your average lay Catholic especially you know college age to really appreciate the the beauty and depth of the sort of church hierarchy and institutional structure uh, and I think Cardinal Burke's gracing us with his presence tonight will will kind of really give uh, great credence to that um, and, and put it put it on display in, a, in, a, in an impressive and beautiful way.